The father, Wesley Gris, spoke to members of the media Sunday evening at the Canadian Brew House in Edmonton's Ellerslie neighborhood. He is devastated by the loss. He misses his son. He describes his son as his whole world. And he is now left to process how to move forward without his best friend. 11-year-old Cash Grist, who lives in Osoyoos, BC, was visiting his father for spring break. The incident happened Monday evening at a home near 82nd Street and 11th Avenue Southwest in the Summerside neighborhood. Police said the boy was attacked by two very large dogs that was declared dead on scene. The father describes Cash as kind, sensitive, and with the biggest heart. He says Cash and the two dogs have interacted plenty of times before, often playing and cuddling with one another. The father says Cash had a beautiful relationship with the roommate, even calling her Auntie Crystal. He says he wants the public to stop finger pointing and directing blame and instead let the family grieve. I would have never thought that I'd be dealing with what I'm dealing with in the first place, you know? Like, I was, it was 10 minutes, 10 minutes. My world went from being happy, loving, hugging my son. And 10 minutes later, my world was completely ripped apart. My heart was crushed. There have been multiple complaints about the dogs from neighbors, and that includes two reports of attacks within the year. The city of Edmonton says one of those attacks is still under investigation. The other attack, that investigation has been complete with no charges laid. Wesley says they received word that the dogs have since been euthanized. However, Wesley says the dogs were never aggressive when he was around, and he would never put his son in danger if he knew there was any issue with the animals. A funeral is now being planned for next Sunday. Cabby Mike Theron, Global News.